So I got an email, actually three emails today. Um, so uh, three of my Mezco figures have been delayed. Uh, the three of the four um, G.I. Joes were supposed to come out any day now. And Roadblock and Snake Eyes have been delayed till Q3. Also my Batman um, from the movie, the recent The Batman movie, has been delayed till Q3. So, oh well, it happens. Uh, there was a new figure that uh, came out either today or yesterday, which is uh, Tetsujin 28 Go FX Ryobot Black Ox. And so there is Black Ox. And I don't know if they do it on purpose, but it's not infrequent when I see these high-end figures come out at the same time as, or around the same time as when the movie is released. So this this movie was from, 19, uh, I'm sorry, this is a series. This was uh, 47 episodes. I'm about a quarter of the way through it. Um, it's from the early 1990s, Tetsujin 28FX. Um, there's the original boy, all grown up, and I don't remember his name. Uh, there's the original, uh, sorry. There's the original Tetsujin 28 back there, and there's Tetsujin 28FX, who is unrecognizable as Tetsujin. Um, the series is okay. It's it's really not that great. It, the animation on here or the artwork on here looks pretty slick. The animation in the um, in the uh, series is it's serviceable at best. Uh, I'm gonna have more to say on it after I finish it, but it's okay. So let me show you because uh, I do have this on pre-order, which is the Tetsujin Go FX, which looks pretty cool. And that's Ryobot Sentinel. Um, the only thing I can say is that uh, the, the the one thing that's a little surprising, so it's $300, and um, it's only a little over 7 inches. So it's, that's a, in the pictures it looks like it would be a, a large figure, but if those numbers are accurate, it's not. Um, so now we have Black Ox, and Black Ox is over $400. Now I did go out, I looked on... Um, Hobby Link Japan, and there's Black Ox for $300.83. Uh, $300 and um, I have gone through and taken it to the point where it was ready to ship. And the shipping was like 60 to $70. They won't list shipping for pre-orders, but they will on if you're ordering something that's available now. They'll give you all like eight different shipping options. So you have the cheapest is like I don't know, four months or something like that. But for anything reasonable, it's, it's about 60 or $70. So you have to factor that in when you consider the price. This is what I consider Black Ox. I've never, I can't recall any time where I've seen a figure redesigned, or at least it's very rare when a figure is redesigned and improved. So this is a very iconic look to, um, to a robot figure. This looks like, yeah, it looks okay. So, again, this one's a little bit taller, 7.28, 18 centimeters. Um, and it's ironic because it was just today when I was watching the current episode that it featured this black ox. And then they come out with this. Um, so, here's a look at the figure. Looks pretty nice. I assume that 7.28 is up to his horns, not up to the... That is a lot of money to pay for a 18-centimeter figure, I will admit. So this is why I'm not going to pre-order it, because it is a Transformer. Um, and I've just had so, such bad luck with transforming figures. The uh, Tetsujin 28FX is not a Transformer, so I'm, I'm going with that one, but... Uh, I'm not really impressed with the look of it. I, I was going to get it right up until I saw that it's a transforming figure. And then I said, no, I'm, I'm going to skip skip that one. But if I were, I probably would have gone with um, Hobby Link Japan because of the price. Even with the shipping, it would have been uh, a better option. And it's not inconceivable that that price may drop because... That actually happened with Boss Borat, where they listed it, I think, at 
$400 and then later dropped the price down a little bit. So maybe at some point they, they figure out that there's a more reasonable price. But anyway, if you're into Tetsujin 28 or if you're into Tetsujin 28FX, then uh, here's a figure that can go along with your uh, Tetsujin 28FX Ryobot. So there you go. Black Ox.